One year has passed since the Biden administration's hasty and disorganized exit from Afghanistan. Scenes of desperate Afghanis clinging to American military planes as they took off shocked people around the globe. Also shocking people was a massive suicide bombing at the Kabul airport, which killed 13 U.S. military and 183 civilians. The Taliban promised an open and inclusive Islamic government. Instead, there's been a suffocating crackdown against females and minorities, according to Amnesty International. Christians, meanwhile, are still managing to somehow meet with other Christians on the ground. And according to reports, Christianity is now growing faster in Afghanistan, and there's cause for optimism on that front. So continue to pray for the gospel to take root and grow in Afghanistan and trust that our God is able to prosper in the most unlikely of places.